In this experiment, we're going to be doing two different experiments. Yes. We're going to be mixing chemicals, and we're going to be using a pH indicator to see which ones change which color. So this morning, we made an indicator out of purple cabbage, and this is what it looks like initially. And we're going to add it to these different substances, and then we're going to see what colors they change. Is color change evidence of a chemical change? Yes. Yes, it is. Right? All right, so let's add some to the vinegar. Starts out kind of a bluish. Ooh. Did the color change? Yes. Yes, it did. And mom, that didn't turn the chemical. Actually, it was that my experience or yours. It's both of ours. All right. Now, let's see what happens when we add it to the bathroom cleaner. Like bread juice. Yes. So there's the vinegar, which is we know an acid, and there's the bathroom cleaner, which we know is a base. What do you think is going to happen when we add it to isopropyl alcohol? I don't know. I think you'll. I think you'll get so bothered. Let's see what happens. Mm -hmm, I'll keep that too. Oh, that one didn't really change a whole lot, did it? It's it's a chemical change. Chemical change in this science video. It's a very minor, minor change. Okay, let's add it to the. That was a chemical change. All these are chemical. Changes. Let's add to milk. It didn't do really anything. A minor change, yes. Let's add it to the soapy water. Donna from Donna. Look at the color there. It, it got, turned turquoise. Yes, turquoise or blue. Or teal. teal. Alright, our last chemical mixture we're going to do is fruit juice. Fruit juicy juice. What color is that one? Kind of a pink, kind of a pinkish red. And this juice is, is fruit punch juice. Yes, so here are all our results. We've got... Which one? Purple? Blue. Which one do you like the most? Light purple, dark purple, kind of a maroon color, and vinegar. Well, right. well, what's your favorite color? Oh, that's red. I don't know. These are all pretty colors. My, my favorite but, is that. All right. Not so, um, so, so when you mix chemicals, you get chemical changes, which means you make new chemical chemicals. And you can... And you can make the world in a different, different website. All right, let's say bye. Bye. bye.